I will toast the happy couple. And I will wish a plague of misery upon them. I have a lonely, empty future. No one to love. No one at all. You have me. No <laughs> one. <laughs> Is that why you're sticking around? <laughs> you think I'm gonna tread one desperate, vacuous rent boy for another one? No. Well, you see the lifestyle I have. Home dripping with money. You think you're gonna cash in? Shut up! No! <laughs> then why are you here? Why do you care? You're my father! Please see me, Grant. Have we heard a knocking? Or a coat? <laughs> oh, you're soaked. Is it raining? I hadn't noticed. I just came over to see if you had any father son bonding tips. You're always so good. James, I'm sorry, but I haven't got time for your weird mind games. Games? Of course. Fathers play games with their sons, don't they? Football games, board games, DIY, gay conversion therapy games. Are you taking something? I wish I had, because then I could believe that I'm hallucinating. And then I hadn't just met my teenage son, Romeo. He's been living right here in the village. Isn't that sweet? Did you know that the prostitute you paid to cure me of my homosexuality got pregnant? James, please stop. Did you know? James, we tried everything we could to keep you from finding out about this child. We... Danny, I, I, I don't think this is doing anyone any good. I, I think we should just go home. Who is we? Me and Donna Marie. James, I paid her a fortune to stay away. And she promised me that she would never tell the boy who his father really was. Well, surprise, surprise. She lied! Congratulations. You've ruined my life. Again! Oh, James, don't. 